Welcome back everyone at Twisted Gaming TV. Today we're going to show some uh, games I've added to the collection. Some are uh, graded games that I got back, some that I just bought. Uh, so let's check it out, okay? So first off, let me see. Okay, so first off, I'm missing one game, but I'll just tell you what it is. I got Super Mario uh, 3D All-Stars for the Nintendo Switch. Got that. Left that over in the bar area. <laughs> okay, so the first one is a complete box. Wipeout 64. Whew. Box a little jacked up here, but I really just bought it for the game, you know, but it came with a box anyway, so I was like, okay, that'll, that'll work. We can do that. You know, got that for a good price. Wipeout 64 for the Nintendo 64. And then we got Mario Golf 64. Been wanting this game for a while for the Nintendo 64, but I wanted one with the box. I didn't want just the game or whatever. So pretty nice condition. I mean, it's it's not mint mint, but I mean, you know, it, it looks good. At least the front looks really nice. That's nice. I like it. And of course, a game that you know I want to say it's come out came back came out a couple of weeks ago, possibly. And yes, I haven't played it. I, I was gonna do a live stream on it, and then all these other games were coming out, and I, I I just wholly forgot I had the game, which is completely stupid. But I got Tony Hawk Pro Skater One Plus Two. Yes, I'm trying to get the glare off there. Anyways, you know the game. But uh I'm gonna do a live stream on this pretty soon. Uh maybe next few days or whatever. But funny story behind this, I um I, I first had it on Amazon, okay? And then it wasn't gonna be here on day one, it was gonna be here like five to ten days later. And I was like, really? So I canceled that, right? Went to Target uh online and I placed the order and I was gonna, you know, go pick up. Well, I arrived to Target about two hours earlier, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna cancel that order, okay? And I'm just gonna buy it in the store. So I bought it in the store, and as soon as I bought it in the store, I got an alert on my phone: "Hey, your pickup's ready." I'm like, really? So I gotta cancel that. So then I have a copy, right? And then I get an email later from Amazon that the order I made on there. Uh, couldn't be canceled because it already shipped. I'm like, really? And then it arrived two days later. So that was, so I have two, which this one came loose, which is stupid. Anyways, um, now this next game is um, beginning to be pretty rare just because they took it off the uh, PlayStation to Store. You can't buy it digitally. You have to buy it physically. I guess because the license ran out or something. I don't know. But anyways, I hopped on the bus and freaking got two of them. Um, you know, these were a little pricey, but I think they'll go up in value. And then I got them graded too. Rory McIlroy PGA Tour for PlayStation 4. This one is from VGA graded. Uh, got an 8 point. 85, 85, sorry, near mint condition, okay, has the silver, silver holographic logo on that, and then I got another one, because I don't know why I bought these, <laughs> and then I went to get this graded, and this one got an 8.5 gold, okay, or 85 plus, sorry, I'm on the, the water grade system, 85 plus so not too bad pretty awesome i haven't played the game um I, I didn't buy this one for some reason i don't know why i don't know why i didn't buy it oh well anyways so i'm gonna sell the lowest grade on that and keep the highest grade of that and now um some games i showed off probably about two months ago because a lot of games took forever to grade these um, so I got four new graded games that came in, okay? So, the first one. Now, I already had this game, but I, I, I bought another one to get it graded because I wanted to see if it could, um, beat my other grade of the same game, and it did. 
My other one got a 9.4A, okay? This one got a 9.6A, so I upgraded. Look at that. Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, look at that. Wow, that's beautiful, ain't it? That is beautiful. That is nice. I like it. Very nice. Sorry about all the glares and crap. Too many, too many lights. Anyways, really nice. Really nice copy. Very happy with that. Okay. And then, what else we got here? <clears throat> oh, this is cool. This one did pretty good. Uh, Twisted Metal Black for the PlayStation 2. Got a pretty high grade. A 9.8 A. I wish it would have got an A plus or an A plus plus. Now, if you don't know the water grade system, the the 9.8 or this number right here, that is them grading the box, um, the casing and everything of the game. Okay, and the letter, you know, it can be a C, it can be a B, or it can be an A, it can be an A plus, A plus plus, which A plus plus being the best. And that's when they grade the plastic uh, factory seal around the game, the plastic wrapping. So uh, that's a really good grade for Twisted Metal Black. Very happy with that one. Very happy. And the next one. Ooh, this one got pretty good. Now this one got a 9.4 A+. So see the seal on this one. The plastic wrap on this one did good. And this is Mortal Kombat Deception for the PlayStation 2. 9.4 A+. It's nice, ain't it? Whew. Look at all the glares in this room, man. I got so many lights and so much crap around. So please forgive me for that. But yeah, that's, that's really nice. Really nice. Now, if everybody knows the um, <clears throat> like the theme theme park um, games back in the day and stuff, well, they made a couple of other variations. So the next one I'm gonna show is for the PlayStation One, nine point four A plus. Okay, can you guess what it's what it is? What game is it? Theme hospital. Kind of like theme park, but you know, you run a, a hospital or whatever. Now, this was a pretty cool game. I didn't like it as much as um, the theme park games or, or roller coaster tycoon, but uh, you know, back in the day, I played all these on the PC. Um, and I think it started with Roller Coaster Tycoon. That's the that's the one that um, started it all. I think is Roller Co Roller Coaster Tycoon, and then they did Roller Coaster Tycoon Two, and then uh, you know, then they had all the expansion packs and stuff. I used to play that on the PC for hours and hours of the day, and that was a dope game. That was a that was a fun game. I think they they've uh, updated the game where you can actually have it on uh, on uh, new PCs now. I think I have it on this computer somewhere. I think I, I think I did that. Yeah, Roller Coaster Tycoon, classic. Yeah, and you can play it on Windows 10, which is pretty awesome. I'm glad they did that. But anyways, yeah, those are some of the games I've gotten. Um, I, I've gotten a couple of other few games, but. I'll have to find them. They're somewhere in this crazy place. And then I also got a a big um, six foot Rockstar Games L.A. Nor banner. Um, that that's pretty awesome. I got it really cheap. A friend hit me up on um, uh, on Facebook and told me it just came up on eBay and said, "Hey, you need to go get this now. You know, real cheap. If you don't get it, I'm gonna get it." Uh, Thomas Bain. Thomas Blaine, 
uh, told me that, one of my friends, uh, another big gamer dude. Um, but uh, yeah, I got that, and I'll, I'll put a picture of it of it up now uh, so you can check that out. But it's it's pretty dope. I got it over in the bar area because I, I, I was losing some room in the game room because I got so much crap in here. But uh, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment, like, and subscribe. I always comment back. Until next video, I'll see you later. And sometime um, during this next week, I'm going to be going live quite a bit. We're gonna be we're gonna be some gaming, so get ready for that. Anyways, have a great week.